Cuidado. Uh, this song is off, uh, off the con. Fixing off the hook is off the hook. Um, it's really interesting because last night uh, there's been so many. We've been doing so many interviews on this uh, on this tour, and uh, and one of the questions I keep getting asked is, do we? Which I don't think anyone has ever asked me this question before, but um, or I mean maybe sporadically um, over the years, but not with such great frequency. Um, people keep asking me, do I ever? Like when I go to bed or when I'm like sitting around in my house, do I ever just put on <coughs> like Tegan and Sarah with like our records? And uh, she's like, totally. No. I'm like, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. like uh, I can't actually think of. Um, I mean, I, I would never, I would never, for just enjoyment purposes, listen to our records um, because when I'm listening to them, it feels like, um, like I, I, I'm, 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 I'm uncomfortable and very, it, it, like part of what makes music so amazing is how much you can sort of um, withdraw or detach or whatever, and you sort of, um, like for, without sounding cliche, like lose yourself in the music, and I, and I'm not, it's not a criticism of our music, or I'm not trying to be even funny, I just can't really listen to us without thinking of it in a really uh, clinical way, and so I don't ever think to myself like, while I'm making dinner tonight, I'm going to also, you know, microscopically deconstruct um, our third record and also drink this wine. I don't really do it very often, but anyways, because I was being asked so much about it last night in my bunk on the way from Toronto to Ottawa, I actually listened to the con on my on my iPod, and um, I slept so bad. It was, <laughs> such a weird night, it put me in such a, it put me in a really awful place. Anyways, I, not awful, that's fair, I would say. I mean, it was like, it was the opposite of relaxing, and, uh, and at like one point, like, I almost got that, like, the, the, the sort of, like, pre, um, where your feet, where the toes get really stiff, like, you're gonna have a muscle. <laughs> spasm. Spasm, thank you. Um, I, my toes almost started to have one of those spasms, and I was like, clearly I'm too tense to listen to this record right now. And then the bus started moving, and then I was only <clears throat> maybe like three quarters of the way through the record, but I stopped listening because I was afraid that we would get into a bus accident, and people would find my body, and they would look at my iPod, and it would be funny me, and then, and then that would be in my obituary, and would be like, you know, um, guy I'm listening to her own band. You know, like, like Sarah was found, um, you know, clutching um, GQ issue with Rihanna on cover while listening to Keegan and Sarah. Like, oh, that's weird. <laughs> that happened to me. Thought I would tell you. Anyways, <clears throat> this one I did hear and I enjoyed the treatment of it very much, but uh, I realized that I sing one part of it wrong live and that is what's going to be going through my head while I'm singing it for you tonight, and perhaps you know the words and um, you want to sing along, and it's weird because in, in most countries people don't need permission to sing along, but in Canada on this tour I've realized that Canadians are very shy and polite and lovely, but if you want to sing along,
Yeah.